today's video we got a problem here and um, this is the high tower armory bullpup kit for my high point 10 millimeter carbine I'm gonna roll in some footage but a while back I started doing a series of videos called reloading 10 millimeter with CW and while I was out filming one of those videos we were actually getting keyholing. The bullets were keyholing on the 25 yard line. And when I got home to clean the gun, I found this. All right, let's get out and check the target. Yeah, we're definitely keyholing on these. So, all four of those there, and one here. So, the bullets were all over the place, and that was the only clean shot we had. All four of these went through sideways. The stock has broken half right here. So, the only thing keeping it together now is this area right here where you can put a sling on it now here is the high point carbine back in its original configuration this gun is clear there's no mag in it there's nothing in the chamber because i wanted to take this back out to the range because i had some other 10 millimeter ammo testing to do so here's my thoughts this gun has been terrible with accuracy it doesn't matter if i'm using reloads factory ammo i could get decent groups with it at 25 yards but once i pushed it out to 50 and i don't care how or what ammo i was using at 50 yards i mean i was getting like five inch groups with this my original thoughts were maybe this stock was causing the problem and if you look here your barrel comes through the front so at first I was kind of thinking well maybe there's just too much stuff touching the barrel there could be all kinds of reasons why this thing's not accurate now we're going to fast forward to a couple days ago I put this back in its stock configuration and the accuracy is still garbage now I don't know if it's because I pre-ordered this 10 millimeter, I've had this for a long time. I put an order in as soon as I found out High Point was coming out with a 10 millimeter carbine. So this is probably one of the very first ones to roll out of the factory. Maybe I got some rifling issues with the barrel. I don't know. So we're going to be doing a series of videos here. We're going to go over two things here. One... I'm going to send an email to Hightower Armory with a picture of the stock broke. This does, according to their website, have a lifetime warranty. I do have a P90 bullpup kit from them, too, for a Ruger 1022, and I absolutely love that gun. have had no issues with it. So we're going to find out what their customer service is like. I am going to contact High Point. And what I would like to do is just drive the gun over to them. They're only about 35 minutes from my house. I don't want to screw around with trying to mail stuff to them and all that. I would just take this over there, drop it off, have them fix whatever's wrong with it, or tell me that there is nothing wrong with it, and then just go back over and pick it up. We'll contact Hightower Armory first. I'm going to shoot them an email. Shoot them a couple pictures of this broken stock, and uh, I'll come back and let you guys know what I find out with them. Well, I got my bullpup kit back already. Same day, I email High Tower Armory. I send them a couple pictures of the stock. It's broke. Within two hours, they're already emailing me back. They also emailed me a return shipping label. They paid for the shipping. I sent, I boxed up the broken one, sent it back. Here we are. Eight days later, 
And we've got what looks to be a brand new kit. Now when I talked to them originally, they said they were just going to replace the lower. But I can already tell. Oh, no. Okay, so it's my upper. I can tell here where I had some optics mounted. So, okay, well, that's exactly what they told me they were going to do. They said they were just going to replace the lower. There it is. Got my shell deflector back since I'm left handed. And uh, real quick, in the next video, I might as well just tell you guys now. I've already got the high point back also from high point seven day turnaround total sending the gun out getting it fixed and getting it back now I'm gonna wait till the next video to tell you what I went through with high points customer service but uh I might as well just tell you now I am uh, completely satisfied with both of them high tower armory was awesome to work with and so was high point all right, the next video, we will talk about the high point customer service. And then I'm going to get this gun all put back together. And in the third video, we're going to take it out to the range and see if it's any more accurate. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one.